Hey there internet, I'm Hamster Bomb, and I am really confused today. So this is a strange video, I normally don't have to do anything as weird as this, but uh, I'm in my backyard right now, and I'm very busy doing a lot of different things and YouTube video stuff all the time, as I always am, um, but uh, I'm usually stuck doing really stupid projects that don't make any sense, and no one would ever believe me of how weird they are. So this is finally my chance, I'm just gonna show you and document how ridiculous this is, and I'm gonna try and figure out what the heck is going on in um, my backyard. Um, right now, I'm actually sitting over a little friend of mine. Uh, he's a chipmunk. I'm not sure where he is, but he hides in here. Um, he's been running around back and forth for a while now. He's got nothing to do with the story, but he actually might set off my triggers that I have set up later. What I'm actually um, gonna be documenting here is uh, something weird that's happening in the actual lawn itself. I'm gonna walk around and show you guys this. So. I'm not sure if I'm getting like some sort of, uh, um, uh, I can't tell if there's some animal that's coming to my yard and digging up these holes you can see. Um, there's a lot of these holes and I'm gonna go around here just so you can see this. Um, just yesterday, I went out and I took all the holes that were over here and I covered them back up and stomped them down just like I just did with that one. I did that for all of these and um, they're all either overturned again or dug out again. Um, this is also, this was something I was pouring on top of it. Ignore that. Um, it, there's, honestly, like, even by this shed here, there's, like, no damage to the shed at all for whatever the heck caused all these holes in the ground. And I've been looking this up, trying to figure out what would cause all this damage. This is a good shot here. Just It's, it's really hard to pick this up on camera, how like what all this really is but seriously it's it's just my all my grass is dying because something is coming around here overturning all of these little holes um and the thing is i'm not seeing any footprints hi there's me uh, i don't know here like this is the worst of it this is really hard to see because of how much uh of the leaves are coming down right now but seriously it's it's insane and there's tons of this it's everywhere you can kind of see it all out here, where it suddenly stops. That's where all the holes stop. They're all over the place. I'm even scared of stepping in um, deer poop because there is a ton of it out here. Now, what I'm trying to figure out, for one, is why is this only happening in my yard? Look around. Nothing. Nothing in anybody else's yard, just mine. And it, the, whatever this is that caused this, it really, really likes this spot because I just, like I said, flipped these back over just yesterday. And I came back out again, and this is what I found in the morning. All these, all these holes. And actually, back here, this was fresh from just last night. There's, I'm trying to get like some of these close-ups of these holes. If I can show anything in here. I'm expecting there's like something in here that they're digging for. I don't need, know if it's like buried nuts from squirrels that something's going for, maybe grubs that a raccoon wants. Um, but honestly, because of all the deer droppings, I think it has something to do with deer. But what are the deer doing? This is insane. Do you see this? This is my yard. Okay, like, I don't know if the, the scope of this is showing up. Look, that's a normal yard. What the heck is that? And it's getting worse every day. This is new over here. They're just starting to come back in this direction. Um, like I said, I'm not seeing any tracks of any kind in here. I have no idea what's causing any of this stuff, but I'm honestly really sick of it. And I've got a plan. And what I'm gonna do is go upstairs, actually, to that window. Going up to that window, and I'm gonna put a camera up there, a webcam of mine, hooked up to a laptop, and I'm going to have it set to motion detection to watch this overnight, because if they are showing up every night, because they just showed up yesterday, I'm saying they, because I can't imagine any one thing could possibly do this much damage every single day to my yard. It's insane. So I have security, <laughs> I know this sounds crazy, so I have no idea what this is. I've been looking this up, I've been Googling this, and um, like, uh, People online say, like, oh, well, if they're, you can tell by which kind of hole or what kind of damage is under the yard, what left it. And people say, like, oh, it's got to be like a skunk or a possum or a raccoon or something if it leaves a hole like this. 
but there's no tracks. And then of course, why would there be so many mounds of deer poop just in here? Not in my neighbor's yards or anything, just here. There's a ton of it. I didn't show you how many like mounds, but I can't even count how many mounds of deer crap are out there. It's a lot. And um, with all of that, I, there's something weird. Like if it was deer, there would be droppings, you know, well, yes, but then why there would be prints in addition to this? You can't tell me they would overturn that much dirt and nothing ever steps in it. It's like, a human couldn't even do that. And then if it really is deer fighting, if it's like mating season or something, that tree right there should have some scratches all over it. And so should that, um, what, what is this? This uh, shed right here. That should have scratches on it. It doesn't. Nothing. And there were holes when I was patching it just yesterday. There were holes all around it. Inches from the side of this thing. None of it was touched. So I'm thinking we have little raccoon buddies. I don't know what they're going for. And they're coming back every night and it's just here. So I have no idea what's going on. That's why I wanted to let you guys know. I don't know if this is going to be like a multiple part thing or however I'm even going to figure this out. But this is, this is a big stupid deal because this is a big project I've been trying to work on. Trying to figure out what the heck is going on back here and what I'm going to do to stop it. Um, so first off is identifying the issue and the first thing I just did is my first test is I've already got our webcam software set up there and hopefully if I stand out here in the zone that is supposed to set it off and I wave to it it will see us and pick us up later there's some of that deer crap if you don't believe me it's everywhere absolutely everywhere I'm really scared I, I'm stepping in it I probably am it's just all over the place so anyway I've laid my trap i didn't overturn any of the extra ones today i mean some other you saw me do a few out here so i'm walking around i have no idea what i'm doing anymore um but anyway these are some of the stupid things that i have to do <laughs> that, that i swear nobody believes me i've got this mysterious thing attacking my lawn in the middle of the night overturning dirt and it's not like i see grubs or anything or not like snuts from squirrels or anything in there i don't know but mr chipmunk who lives right here Mr. Chipmunk, we saw at the top of the episode, wherever you went. He's been scurrying back and forth all day today. He knows. He knows something. And I want to find out what Mr. Chipmunk cannot keep his secrets from me. Let's get inside and take a look at the webcam. And we are inside the house. And I am set up and ready to go. These friggin' stupid whatever things are attacking my yard. With this, it's, not, it's honestly one of my crappier webcams, but it's gonna get the job done. I got some videos I gotta record today, so this is gonna work. It's filming right down there. Go and held up in a really weird way on this tripod to laptop. Laptop I've got set up with some security footage thing that's gonna look up whenever something moves in designated spots that I've already highlighted on the freaking screen and it's ready to go. It's gonna pop up and show us when someone's out there in the middle of the night, hopefully, and I want to see. I'm excited to see what the heck's going on because I'm really upset about my freaking yard being attacked in here, even though, you know, the way I got this set up, it kind of looks to my neighbors like I'm probably just watching them, you know, or, you know, trying to catch somebody have sex or something, which I'm not. I'm looking at my yard unless they want to come right here. And have sex, in which case that's exactly what I guess I'm doing. But uh, don't do that, neighbors. It's a warning to you. Not in my yard, unless that's what was leaving the tracks. Anyway, let's see what our uh, nights finally give us. All right, guys. Wow, that's bright. We are outside in the middle of the night now. All set up and ready to party. And, uh in more ways than one. So, I found out upstairs that I uh, couldn't see a thing. So, what I decided to do was throw one of those things that lights up <laughs> your house with like Christmas lights up in the tree. So now hopefully it's gonna give uh, our little hidden camera upstairs up in there. You might be able to make out the little red light. Uh, I can't quite see it on this video, but I see it in person. There's an itty bitty little light up in there. And uh, hopefully that's just enough. 
um, for this. I don't have any other lights. Um, if, if anything, this might set the mood if we're looking for some deer who are doing some love dancing. Because other than that, I have no idea what to do. Um, that's the only back porch light I've got, and it is not good enough. Um, so from a distance, that's all this is doing. <laughs> it's practically nothing. But at least now I might be able to see a shadow go by, and then maybe we'll be able to tell what made the shadow. Let's see how this goes. Night one. Hopefully I have one. Night one. dawn of the second day. I don't know how much time remains because the camera did run overnight as it was supposed to. Um, but as I can see from the clips down here that it was captured, I just turned this off by the way so it wasn't recording, you know, more stuff like this, which is me walking into the room and the glare on the window. Um, I don't think it actually caught anything last night because I'm pretty sure these lines here is the door, like the light of the door behind us opening with the hallway on. So that's us setting it up. And nothing after that point. And this ran all night. In fact, I'm kind of worried about my screen because I think it might have been on the entire time. So, oh man, my throat hurts. This is the first I've talked today and I didn't realize, I guess I'm feeling a little sick this morning. Um, Anyway, so that is a shame. We have no footage to run through other than maybe running through some of these just in case. And I will run through some of these just for this video, but this is not over. This is not over. I'm going to figure it out. I would go out there right now and like analyze if there are new dirt mounds than normal. Like we can already see some in that bottom right corner. Um, I don't remember if those are in the same places uh, or if there are more over in that really, really dirty spot. Um, that looks like leaves, but it's mostly dirt. Um, I can't right now just because it is raining. I don't want to. I'm not feeling that great anyway. And, uh, huh. I gotta figure out what to do for round two. I got a feeling that I'm gonna get, um, like a floodlight. A real floodlight. Hang it from higher in the tree. Suspend it down. But I don't know about that because I feel like where they actually went wasn't just from the tree. You can kind of see the wiring of where I did this. Maybe. I'm not sure how clear this is. But if that's not where they went, I feel like they went over there. Back that way. I can't tell. But anyway, I'm going to roll tapes anyway just in case because we're going to make a mini montage vlog series out of this because I will figure it out. At the very least, I get to show this to you guys and see if anybody out there has any idea what the heck is causing all the damage in my yard and, you know, making me lose sleep over something stupid like this. But anyway, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. What the heck's going on in my yard? I have no idea. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like the videos and subscribe for more. I will see you all in day two. Boop.